Well, you can tell when a cold front went through earlier on today. Temperatures in the mid 50s early this afternoon, but within an hour down five degrees and we've been dropping ever since then. So uh, looking to stay on the cooler end for the rest of the week after that colder air entered the picture earlier today. The showers and storms are gone, though, so that uh, noisy start to last night, same to today. Uh, that is all off to our east. We won't see any other kind of wet weather coming in. You may notice something on exact track radar to our north, but that'll track over Lake Michigan. For us, it's quiet, cloudy, and cool weather sliding in over the course of the rest of the day. And we're going to stay quiet for a couple days, partly because there's an area of high pressure over Canada that's going to put just enough influence on our region to keep the weather systems away from us uh, through the end of the week. By the time we get to the end of the week, though, different story may have uh, much more in the way of a hint of winter in the air by that point. So we're staying quiet for now. Uh, this is good timing, though, because it is severe weather preparedness weeks. So we don't have to worry about active severe weather uh, as you might start to think about what's going on later this season. So if we do get severe weather, just make sure you have uh, different ways to get weather alerts like a weather radio, the 13 Weather Authority app. Uh, you can also make sure that you keep your phones charged up. If you hear about severe weather in the forecast, charge up those devices so they're ready to go in case you lose power for a while and of course adjust your plans or cancel them if need be now no severe weather this week like we just mentioned it's gonna stay quiet for a while but this is the time of year to start getting ready for that and we brought you some facts earlier in the newscast we'll be doing so all throughout the rest of this week as we may try to help you get pre prepared for that busy season later on tonight though mainly cloudy and brisk as we drop down to 32 tomorrow mostly cloudy quiet a little breezy definitely cooler than today down about 10 degrees in the mid 40s then keeping an eye on the end of the week Thursday night into Friday potential chance for accumulating snow here what complicates this though is that there may be enough warm air to mix with some rain showers which will definitely affect uh, what we see for precipitation we're also still about four days out so of course like we saw last week that all could change in the coming days right now it looks like there's a decent chance for accumulating snow but we'll keep you up to speed throughout the week as we get closer to that potential weather system on Friday you can see by that point we're down to the 30s and we could stay there this weekend, looking a little chilly as we get into Saturday and Sunday. In your most accurate 10 day forecast, that will be a trend to monitor this week and beyond. We might be looking a lot more in the way of wintry throughout much of next week rather than those 50s like we felt as of today. All right, we'll have to enjoy these mid 40s for the next few days. Thanks, Alex.